Xabi Alonso will be Liverpool's favourite for the solid defender if he agrees to replace Jurgen Klopp. Liverpool should beat Real Madrid to sign a fast defender. Klopp wanted him years ago. Welcome, my friend, to your news channel of the greatest club in the world. In the search for a reliable partner for Virgil van Dijk, Liverpool has been associated with some defenders from Bayer Leverkusen, and the name of Edmund Tapsoba has emerged on the Reds list. According to the Mirror, Alonso identified Tapsoba as someone he would like to take with him in his next job. Of course, Liverpool is not the only club Alonso could go to next. Team Talk recently reported that he has doubts about facing the pressure of taking over from such a revered coach as Klopp. Additionally, Bayern Munich, another of Alonso's former clubs since his playing days, and who also knows they will change coach in the summer when Thomas Tuchel leaves, is considered a strong candidate to make an offer to the man who seems about to end his long career of consecutive Bundesliga titles. And the current conclusion is that Tapsoba, who fully embraced Alonso's vision, is willing to go wherever his agent goes. In other words, if Liverpool appoints Alonso, they would become favourites to sign Tapsoba. If he goes to Bayern, the 25-year-old player could also. After all, only Jeremy Frimpong and Jonathan Ta have played more games for Bayer Leverkusen during Alonso's era. Tapsoba is also linked to clubs like Manchester United, Chelsea and Tottenham. But they may have to be discarded if they do not also become possible destinations for Alonso. The way things stand, it seems to be a battle between Liverpool and Bayern for the 42-year-old player, with confidence growing among the Germans. Why is Liverpool thinking about defensive targets? Liverpool may have to draw up a list of alternatives, not only for the coaching position but also in terms of defensive targets, in case Alonso and Tapsoba join Bayern. But there is still a chance to see them together at Liverpool. And given that Van Dijk likes to play on the left side of central defence, despite being right-footed, putting Tapsoba in the right centre-back position could be wise. With Matip injured, Liverpool currently has Ibrahima Kanati, Joe Gomez and Gerald Kwanza as options to partner with Van Dijk. Hiring a new defender, if not an absolute priority, is something Liverpool may consider, especially if they hire Alonso, and even more so if he wants to use a three-man defence, as he did with Bayer Leverkusen. Liverpool's search for a new manager to replace Jurgen Klopp has come into focus now that Michael Edwards and Richard Hughes have taken the helm. While Xabi Alonso remains the top candidate, interest expressed by Bayern Munich has led Liverpool's executives to explore alternatives. Among these options is the name of Brighton and Hove Albion's manager, Roberto De Zerbi. According to a recent report from Give Me Sport, Edwards and Hughes have identified De Zerbi as a viable choice should negotiations with Alonso fail to progress. At 44 years old, the Italian has received praise for his work at Brighton and is considered an appealing option for Liverpool. Although it's unlikely that Brighton would release him easily, Liverpool fans should closely monitor developments, especially after Brighton's willingness to engage in fair negotiations, as seen in Alexis McAllister's summer transfer. Liverpool's interest in hiring Roberto De Zerbi is a matter worth attention, particularly considering his solid reputation and the praise from influential figures like Micah Richards and Stephen Warnock. And you, as a fan, what are your thoughts on the possibility of Liverpool hiring Roberto De Zerbi as the new manager? Liverpool will face its first season without Jurgen Klopp in almost nine years this summer, promising to be a peculiar transfer window. If last year was chaotic with many departures from Klopp's old guard, this summer could follow a similar pattern. The question arises, could Andy Robertson leave Liverpool this summer? Among those who could be discarded by Liverpool's team by Edwards and Hughes is Andy Robertson. There are indications that the Scotsman's quality has diminished in recent seasons. This season, he has recorded only one goal and one assist for Liverpool in all competitions, far from the high standards he set for himself throughout his career. At 30 years old, he is approaching a phase in a football player's career where decline is inevitable. With two years left on his current contract, this summer could represent the best opportunity for Liverpool to sell him for a high value, especially considering the interest from the Saudi Arabian market in players like Robertson. Meanwhile, Liverpool may consider replacing the left-back with a younger, long-standing candidate for the position, who may also be available this summer. And you as a fan, what do you think of Robertson's possible departure? Do you agree with this possibility? Alfonso Davies is the perfect transfer target for Liverpool for several reasons. When he played for the Vancouver Whitecaps, 
Davies reportedly caught the eye of Liverpool, as stated by rousing the cop. Although he ended up transferring to Bayern Munich, he excelled there, becoming one of the most talented left-backs alongside Andy Robertson in world football. With victories in the Champions League, participation in the World Cup, and numerous Bundesliga titles, Davies has proven his worth. With just one more year left on his contract with Bayern Munich, he seems ready for a new challenge. While Real Madrid is showing active interest, Liverpool is also in the race. If this interest is confirmed, Edwards and Hughes should do everything possible to outbid Real Madrid in the race for his signature. With his quality on the flanks and at 23 years of age, Davies would be a long-term investment for Liverpool, with the potential to shine at Anfield in the coming years, given his speed and skill on the field. Thank you very much for watching. Until the next video.